<laughs> Howdy. How you going, all right? <laughs> Good. We're just gonna um, we're just gonna slip up here around the corner. All right. I'll jump in and follow you. Okay. Should I jump in the car over here and follow you? Or walk? Near if you don't think it's too smelly. No, that's fine. Whatever's best. Jump in the back seat here with All right. <laughs> the main purpose is to give uh, Muzz and Possum a, a blowout just to run. Um, it's a little bit, it's about 300 yards, 300 metres. Uh, the sand is pretty soft, so it's a pretty hard run. Um, and um, the big white dog is uh, Snoopy, um, fire me. Um, he's pretty much retired now, he's got a bit of a wrist issue, but um, he's a good lead dog. Um, he, he knows what I'm doing down there. And um, he'll come. Um, I just have to let these people on the beach know that we've got dogs coming so they can watch out because Snoopy will clean them up. We've got these expensive squeakers. Oh, yeah. You know, you are going to go to the shop and pay big money for squeakers. <laughs> and um, so we use these expensive squeakers and the, they love them. And um, so they'll come to that. Um, I'll, I'll use it. I, I don't often use the whistle, but just in case there's people about sometimes, it lets them know that we've got something going on. Let's do it, eh? Now he's already let Muzz go. So when Snoopy gets here, he'll take this first lure. You can see how fast Buzz is, he's almost caught him already. <laughs> Come on, Muzzy! Oh, Poss! Good girl! Hey, good girl! Freshens them right up, gives them a totally different outlook on what they're doing, and as you can see, it doesn't take anything for them, they just run there, they know, they know they've got a price at the end and as you can see it's a dirty old bit of carpet. And, um, but, um, it doesn't take any incentive for them to go and look, I think it's the key to having a good race dog. They've just got a lot of run for you and uh, well they don't come any more honest than this little fella I can assure you. What does it mean to be in a big race like the Musselbrook Cup, Sam? Look, to be honest with you, I reckon he's a champ. If he gets a bit of clear space early, um, he's drawn better this week. Um, but bear in mind the big three are um, sort of group type dogs. This fellow's about to have his fourth birthday uh, next week. Um, so he'll be a master's dog. Um, well, but having said that, you know, He's run two weeks ago at the garden when he went 29.37. It's the best run of his life. And um, he just seems to just seems to be improving with age. What about the dog himself? What does he mean to you? This little fella. Mm. Oh, it's, almost, it's like I own him. Um, I've had him for, oh, I don't know, uh, what is it now? November. November 22, I think I got him. And... Um, you know, we've just sort of got on from day one. And um, he just, I don't know, he just seems to try. Yeah, no, I just love him. He, um, he deserves all the good things that happened to him, I can assure you. You right, big boy? You want to go?